Hey there guys, this is Adrian. Thank you for joining me. Uh, and today we're going to be doing a small update on what games we're going to be playing, when we're going to be playing them. Um, today is, what's today? Okay, today's April Fool's Day, April 1st, 2016. But I'm not actually kidding. This is this is for real, if anybody's wondering. So, we got a few games on the agenda. We're still continuing the Total War Rome 2, uh, Basalia Grand Campaign. I have the saves, I have the thumbnails. Um, once I get Rome 2 uh, downloaded onto my computer, it should be sometime tonight. It's only you know 7:30 at night. I should I should have something downloaded, and uh, you know maybe I can play. I'm not sure. It's it's my neighbors. You know, um, I'm in an apartment, so I don't want to wake anybody or annoy anybody. Um, so if I get that downloaded tonight, I'll play that. If I don't, I could definitely do something like tomorrow. Um, so. We're going to be doing Total War Rome 2, Massalia. I'm not sure how long we'll continue with that. Hopefully I can try and like win the campaign. Um, or if it gets boring or kind of stale or something like that, yeah, you know, um, we'll switch to something else maybe. Um, I was also thinking about maybe starting up a series with historical battles. I think that'd be kind of cool. Um, but, you know, we'll, we'll see how that goes. Um, I'd like to play the historical battles. You know, some of them are really fascinating. I'd actually like to uh, kind of do maybe like a documentary series on some of the historical battles, like the pretext of before the battle, during the battle, after the battle, what happened, when it happened. That'd be kind of cool. Um, let's see, moving on. Obviously, we're going to be doing uh, Counter-Strike Global Offensive. It's an awesome game. It's very, very fun. Um, live streaming with it is a bit finicky just because my internet is not that great. Um, my internet has really been going in and out over time sometimes it's really good but if i try and like stream to twitch and i try to play i usually get um i usually get like like network spikes and lag and all that kind of stuff sometimes it's not bad but sometimes it's not very good either so if i do play csgo or tf2 i might do some offline gaming for a little while i might not stream i might just do my own little thing um just just record it offline so that my internet bandwidth can be put uh, forward totally towards um, running the game and making sure there's no lag or anything like that. And then um, I have been I've been thinking about doing a Victoria 2 um, pop demand mod slash concert of Europe um, campaign as Mexico. Um, I'm taking this this Latin American history class in in my college, and um, you know we're reading about like Mexico and there's there's you know like books I'm reading about the the Mexican Revolution of 1910, all this kind of stuff. And I was like, you know what, man, it'd be cool to, to play through that time period and, you know, go to Victoria too and industrialize and, you know, become an empire and all that kind of stuff. Things that other people could do in real life. So I was actually, I'm really probably going to start this one, Victoria too. Um, I might even start that tonight. Uh, oh yeah, there it is right there. Steam just finished downloading Victoria too. So I got to get PDM and constant Europe. I'll probably throw it on my computer and I might just do a couple episodes of that just to start it up. Um, I'm going to try and do one video of each series every day. I don't want to put out a lot of content that's just like, oh my god, it's just, you know, such a such a huge thing out there. Um, I don't want to, you know, bury you guys in content. So um, I think for now we're going to be focusing on, on Total War Rome 2, uh, Victoria 2, maybe, um, you know, Mexico campaign. And then, um, let's see, it's April 1st. On April, s April 5th? Yes, April 5th, this upcoming Tuesday. It, today's Friday. And four days from now, I'm blanking out. Four days from now, we're going to be doing um, Europa Universalis IV, uh, Mare Nostrum, or Mare Nostrum, however you want to pronounce it. Um, they got a new expansion coming out. I'm going to buy the content pack. I'm going to buy it. We're going to do it. We're going to play it. It's going to be cool. It's, you know, I haven't really done a Europa Universalis campaign um, in great detail or great length for quite some time. So I did want to try that out. That's going to be a lot of fun. We're going to have a good time. Um, like I said, we still have some more possible games on the agenda for the future. We've got Hearts of Iron 3, even though Hearts of Iron 4 is, um, you know, less than two months, of, uh, two months away. Um, Elder Scrolls 4, Oblivion. I've never played Oblivion on the PC. Like I said, I, I tried it once like five years ago or something like that. It never worked out. So it'd be cool just to try that every once in a while. I'm not a huge RPG guy. I mean, like these three right here, Oblivion, Skyrim, and Fallout 4, I own them all. I'm not a huge RPG guy. I usually don't have the time or even like the interest to, to do RPGs. I'm more of a strategy guy myself. I like to think and, you know, um, think about economy and diplomacy and that kind of stuff. But anyway... Maybe we'll do some of that. I'm not sure. Um, Empire, Napoleon, Total War. They're still pretty dated games, but um, 
you know, I'd, I'd like to still have to play them. It'd be fun. We'll, we'll maybe start up a campaign. I don't know. Uh, and like I said, the, the future games that are definitely confirmed that I'm going to be playing a lot, especially during the summer, is going to be Stellaris. comes out um, May 9th, if I'm correct, if I have that right. Hearts of Iron 4 comes out June 6th of this year. Um, EU4, Mar uh, Maria Nostrum comes out on, yeah, next Tuesday. So April 5th. And then uh, Total War Warhammer comes out May 24th. So, um... And that's what we're going to be doing. The The new gaming computer works awesome. The rig is great. And, um, you know, we're going to be putting out a lot of content. I really like this setup. Everything works well. Uh, the GTX 970 on this damn computer is ridiculously powerful. I, like, it blows my mind. So, uh, that's what we're going to be doing. So, I will see you guys soon. And uh, if you like this video, please click the like button. If you dislike this video, please click the dislike button. And uh, be sure to leave a comment. Give me some tips on how I'm doing. And, uh, yeah, thank you. I appreciate it, and I'll see you guys soon.